Okay, howdy folks. Just wanted to show you something that I just picked up. Um, it's a Avenue Big Twin, a 40 horsepower Big Twin. And uh, she's a big motor. For a 40 horse, like look at the size of the power head of it. But it's mostly housing. Um, anyways, I'm getting to the points of it. I did take it apart already. I just wanted to show you what the hood looked like. I have a neat looking engine. Electric start. Evinrude. Uh, it's got to have controls for your boat and all that. But, but uh, it's heavy. And I'm just going to take the hood off here if I can. Okay. Alright. Here we go. All right, here's the big twin here. So now I mean, I just pop the coils off, and this is a very common problem with the, the Evinrudes or their um, their uh, you can see they're always the coils are when they're that age. This is a '64, and I doubt, I highly doubt that it's ever been changed so so um, my plans are is to get it up and running and then um, put it on a boat possibly sell it whatever but the thing is is with these engines once you do get them running like they're great they're damn good engines um, has a fuel bowl system fuel pump some sort of Temperature sensor on the side, which I disconnected. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna. I cleaned the points already. I tried the old coal just to see if I could get spark out of it, and I can't get any spark. So I suspect it's the cracked coils, obviously. So if I can find some ones that I know that are decent or whatever, I'm gonna try those. Um, what else is gonna tell you? Oh yeah, um, when I pop the plugs on this motor they were golden brown both of them so it was running very well then obviously the the, the coils messed up and then it wouldn't run no more so that's kind of good in a sense because low hours basically great compression so we'll see what happens and it will and it will will we'll need a water pump which will be down in the lower unit down there so taken apart but stay tuned I'm gonna get the big old 40 running big twin 40 Evinrude 40 big twin 1964